Stevenson opens the season with a 2-1 win over Newman in extra time. Joined now by Stevenson head coach Graham Miller. Coach, uh, just how you drew this one up, right? Of course. You know, you know, opening day, you want to go to overtime and you've got a game the next day and, uh, you know, leave it to the last minute just to keep the fans entertained. So they did that and that was, uh, it was a great win. Your pride in your team. This is a sport of momentum, right? And you have the, the penalty kick save and then you've got... You know, you're playing up by a man, everything seems to be going your way, and then you give up a goal, and that can be really deflating, especially when you're getting lots of chances and they aren't going in. Your pride in your team to hang in there and grind it out to get the late equalizer. Well, you know what? I actually think the uh, the red card for them actually woke them up. Um, you know, we were dominating the game. We had plenty of shots. They were just playing on the counter, but their red cards seemed to give them a little bit of new life because then you have to play, you have to play with uh, more heart. You have to go after everything because you're playing a man down. And sometimes, you know, that can backfire on the team that has 11, and I think it did. And we let them come back in the game. It was a soft penalty, uh, but great save from Mastelitano, and then we give up a goal in a set piece. But the way the guys responded after that took them a little bit of time, um, but the fact is we kept going all the way to the end. And, uh, you know, we're going to make mistakes. It's the first game of the season, but the guys grinded it out, showed character, and just an unbelievable, you know, overtime win against the uh, – defending Atlanta East champions from last year. I think it jumps out most to me is uh, is the close game thing. You know, nine one-goal losses a year ago to to start the season by winning a close game and a dramatic game. It maybe is a, a, a sign of growth, perhaps, to your team going into this year. Yeah, and that's it. You know, with those nine, goal, nine one-goal losses and the two ties, these are the games that we would have probably maybe, maybe would have lost last year. So the fact that we, you know, came back and tied it and then, you know, took care of it in overtime is just huge for, for what we're looking to accomplish uh, after last year. Right, and how about the heroics of Jay Smith? I mean, he's just, uh, he had about five other chances to score, but he, he got two, so we'll give him that. <laughs> he was waiting to make him the most, the most dramatic, right? Of course, that's the, that's the way these guys are. They try and give me a heart attack every, every two minutes. All right, Coach, we'll see you tomorrow. Congratulations on a great win. Thanks, Glenn. He's Graham Miller. I'm Glenn Clark for GoMustangSports.com.